Hey, what's up you guys? This is Ninja XTX and welcome to the 52nd video in my fifth round of philosophy videos. I was talking to a friend of mine a couple days ago and he he asked me did I think this whole woke culture movement was going a little too far. My reaction to him was this. Woke culture will only go as far as you push it. What woke culture is doing is a direct response to what's been going on in this in this world for decades. So now you have a movement where they're trying to to push up push the human race back we're try they're trying to push the human race back not just black people although black people are black and brown people are disproportionately affected by it we we are disproportionately affected by a lot of the laws we are disproportionately affected by murders, but people, people on the other side don't want to see what they've done. They don't want to see that they contributed to woke culture. If you want woke culture to stop, you have to look at what caused us to start in the beginning or caused what culture to begin in the first place. If you start to change some things, What culture will say, okay, we got our point across and things are changing for the better. That's all we're trying to do. We're trying to help everyone. And when I say we, I mean black, uh, the intelligent Caucasians, um, And yeah, I know I'm going to need a lot of flack for that. And I will explain that next week. We have African American, as I was saying. Intelligent Caucasians. Um, the Latino community. The Asian community, which is another thing I want to cover in an upcoming video um, because what's happening to them is horrible and I want to cover that because that needs to stop as well um, this 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 whole thing well You see, when when you say, "Do you think? Do I think? What culture is going to to full?" Well, I could very well say, "What did white privilege push what culture to do?" And before you say 
There's no such thing as white, white privilege. Walk out your door. Walk out your door. Are you afraid to walk? Are you afraid to walk the streets? I'm telling you, because there are thousands, millions of minorities that are because they don't know there are, excuse me there are thousands of, of people within the minorities that are because they don't know whether they'll come home safely if you don't have that fear then you've got white privilege plain and simple If you automatically think, well, so-and-so will protect me, or this will pro no, don't, the, the. and yeah, I'm going to get biblical here for a minute. The only thing that protects me is knowing that I know where I'm going when I leave this world. The only thing that protects me is my faith. The rest of it is a crapshoot. I hate to put it that way, but as a minority, that's just a that's just a fact of life until something changes for the better. As a minority, we have to worry about that. As other cult other cultures have to worry about it because it's set up the constitution wasn't set up for minorities it was set up for white men And sometimes, you know, minorities were, were considered property. Sometimes the women were also considered property. So that's another thing in itself. So when you have woke or can't, when you ask if woke or canceled culture has gone to four, You in turn have to ask what created woke and cancel culture. Because if you look at it, it's not political. It's really not. And the idiots that make it political, they're just adding to the problem. And I know I'm going to lose a lot of viewers. If I lose a lot of viewers because of what I said, bye-bye, don't need you. If you're here to learn something, keep watching. I'm going to try to teach you. I'm going to try to teach as best I can. All right. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that touched someone's heart. I hope that made someone think about how they may be living life. Please take care of yourselves and each other. One world, one love. If you guys have any questions, comments, requests, etc., please send them to my YouTube account. Or if you know how to get in touch with me on my personal Facebook, uh, my Twitter, my Instagram, or any other form of my social media, please feel free to do so there. Thank you guys for watching. God bless. I will see you guys tomorrow for my next chair by on the screen room uh, session at 11.45. Until then, bye-bye for now.